What is up guys? No need here bringing the lethal and tactical equipment. Now, the first one we're going to start off is lethal. Now, in every Call of Duty, you got to have your frag grenade. It's kind of self-explanatory. Hold it, you get five seconds. But on uh, Call of Duty Ghosts, there's actually a little trigger point. It actually counts down for you. So you're able to throw it at three or four uh, before it actually blows up. Now, next we have our Semtex. A little bit different, you know, in the Call of Duty Black Ops 2, the Semtex was round, just like a grenade. Um, it's a little bit more of an oval now, or not oval, but a, a cylinder, I guess. Um, and same, same explosive time, five seconds, and then it sticks to any surface or enemy. Now, throwing knives, uh, it reminds me of the throwing knives from Modern Warfare 2. They're a little bit delayed, um, in my opinion, but they are actually very fun, and if you do hit the, hit the guy or hit the person, it uh, definitely is pretty, pretty fun. Now, the next is the IED. Uh, imp improvised proximity explosive device so similar to something like a bouncing Betty except it doesn't go zing in the air uh, it kind of just triggers and actually blows up now here's the C4 now you're able to throw a C4 like normal and t tap it with RB now I've always double tapped X um, now they're actually giving it as a tip to actually double tap X right after you throw it uh, very powerful stuff now the last one is the canister bomb it's a mixed chemical bomb that has to be primed before it's released so basically you have to hold it get it ready and then you throw it and then it does some damage now going to some tactical you have the nine bang now holding this actually produces more flashes now if you fully cook this you can actually get up to nine bangs that create basically like an EMP effect now I've used this this is gonna piss off some people um, especially something like hardcore if your teammates are throwing these at you um, you hold it and throw it, it just goes off nine times and just trashes you and you're basically kind of just stuck. Um, so this is definitely going to be something a lot of trollers are going to use, um, which is going to be kind of funny. Now also, you're just your normal concussion, temporarily disorients, slows enemies, your, your, your traditional smoke, uh, and also the trophy system. I love the tro trophy system, it's always been helpful. Um, also now there's the motion sensors are back. It's triggered by enemy proximity, tags the target, allowing to be tracked through objects for a short time. Um, now this also always has been an issue um, for me because it bugs the crap out of me. Uh, anyways, also there's the thermobaric. It's a fuel air grenade that creates a large but low damage blast radius and weakens armor. Now something like this also would be good if you have recon on because it also marks the enemies that it does damage a little bit. Uh, other than that guys, those are the lethal and tactical weapons for Call of Duty Ghosts. Other than that guys, I'm No Need and I'm out. Peace.